I found a little bit of turkey tail mushroom. I was hoping to find some of these today because I am going to dry some of these and um, grind them up and uh, mix them in coffee grounds and people can make um, coffee and it'll have a little turkey tail in it. I'll probably throw some chaga in it and I'll probably give that away for Christmas. But um, something to note when you're looking for turkey tails, get the focus. Make sure it has pores. You see how it has these tiny pores in it? Come on, camera. There we go. See how it has those pores? Turkey tails should have pores. Very tiny pores, very close together. Once again, if only I had a dollar for every time I found one of these mushrooms, I'd be a rich man. More turkey tail, different color, but turkey tail. Well, because I'm already in the mushroom hunting spirit and it's still not even 11 o'clock yet, I've decided that I am going to take a trip down to North Carolina to a place I like to go, don't get to go to too much. And we're gonna see what's down there. So, here I go. So I made it down to North Carolina. Uh, only took me about an hour. And I'm already liking what I'm seeing down here. Uh, saw a couple of old uh, Rosala mushrooms back there. I wasn't sure what kind. They were a little dulled out. Seen some other little mushrooms growing on trees, tiny ones. But and I also just ran into these oysters growing off this tiny stump. They're old, but just getting started and already find stuff so I'm sure I'm gonna find more found a couple deer mushrooms uh, one right here and there was another big one over over there on the same log there's a bunch of this <coughs> beach bracket growing it's just a polypore I'm not sure if this has any um, uses at all I've seen this before um, that's obviously newer stuff the white and that's older so I just saw these things growing down here, so I came over, uh, checked them out, I'm, I, and I'm not really familiar with these um, at all. I'm going to have to look these up later. I'm trying to get the focus. Yeah, these little weird little white puffy, some type of polypore. Found a ton of witch's butter. Probably the most I've seen in one spot. Uh, Normally I don't mess with this stuff. I see it you know, quite often. Uh, but this is the most I've actually seen in one area. So I might actually grab some of this because I was reading that there is some uh, medicinal uses for these. So I'm gonna grab some and I'll look into that when I get home. I never actually picked that stuff before, but it is as slimy as it looks. I'm kind of upset that I started off finding oyster mushrooms and after almost a mile and a half of walking, I haven't found any more. I'm getting ready to head back to the car and head back to Virginia. Uh, I did find some more turkey tail over there. Um, so I found about three nice, I did find some random ones that I didn't record, but I found about three nice clusters today that were not that old. So I'm gonna use those, I'm gonna dry them up, grind them uh, with some other turkey tail I've already found a few weeks ago. And I think I'm gonna mix it with some dried chaga and then put it into coffee grounds. I saw that idea on the internet and I'm gonna try it and maybe give that away for Christmas to people. Uh, but not a bad day um, in two different states. It's supposed to stay warm down here for like at least the next week, probably next two weeks. So I'm sure I'll be back out again. 
before I go up north for Christmas. Thank you all for watching, and I hope I can make another video here soon.